Welcome to the box. Welcome to the box. Welcome to the welcome to the welcome to the pow. week number four. Man, I promise you, every time I get on here, I just feel like myself growing, being able to connect with you guys, and, and letting y'all, you know, spitting some real knowledge. For those that tap in, I say thank y'all. For those that are new to the channel, y'all make sure to hit that subscribe button. But I told myself every time I get on here from this point forward that I have to give God his glory. So the verse of the day is coming from 2 Timothy 1. For the <laughs> Bear with me. I swear I just forgot it. I was like in my mind trying to remember it. But anyway, it's basically telling us that God did not create us to be timid. But God gives us power. God, you know, gives us love. God gives us self-discipline and as i'm sitting here and i'm thinking about what i'm gonna talk about today i had to remember i can't be afraid i can't be afraid of what's next i can't really worry so much about what others are thinking or doing but i have to just know that god created me to be different that god has a plan for me and everything he's gonna do in my life is gonna be big I felt like I was in a place in my life where I cared so much about what others thought of me. Like I was working at the gym, people come in the gym, I'm working there and there's people from high school and they look at me and they're like, yo bro, you're working at this gym now? And I promise you it would hurt me so bad. It hurt me so bad to a point where I quit that job. Like I was like, um, I can't do it. It's so bad now to a point where I drive 45 minutes the other direction because I care so much about what other people thought. Honestly, I do feel like I should be way further than what I am. And it bothers me sometimes when I'm sitting there looking at myself and I'm like, bro, why am I here? I feel like when I'm posting on social media and people look at me like, man, this guy's a clown. He's never going to make it. And I'm like, bro, why do I feel this way? And I'm like, bro, how do I get out of that place of caring what others think? How do I get out of that place of like not worrying about that stuff, not worrying about where you are right now in life? And I said, bro, you just have to do it and know that God has bigger you have to know that you shouldn't be here to be afraid because God is the protector. God gives us power. God gives us love. God gives us self-discipline. And so like, I'm now at this place where I'm like, bro, I don't care. I don't care about the number of views I get. I don't, I don't care what people are saying or doing. I don't care about, you know, what people may be thinking of me. I don't care because it's, it's at that moment where you get to that place where you're like, man, I don't care what other people are doing. It's where, it's where you'll grow. You, you, you show up every day and you're like, bro, I'm doing this for me. And bigger, I'm doing this for God. God gave me, God put me here, so I know there's a reason why I'm here. And that, when you get to that point, bro, that, that's where it's truly, truly deep and inspiring. <laughs> you have to get to that place, man. You have to get to that place where you don't care what others are thinking. You don't care what others are doing, but you're doing it for you. You wake up every day and you're like, bro, I'm going to do better. When you get to that place, I promise you, you'll succeed. You'll do a lot more because you love it, because you want to be better at it. And it's, it's such a better feeling. Like, yo, when you work, you're like, bro, I'm working because I know I got to work to be able to be a provider. Because you know what? You can sit over there and laugh. You know what? You might have millions, but promise you I'll get there one day. I don't care where you are right now, but I only care about God that I serve. I care that I'm going to do bigger and better. And that I'm telling you, bro, the number one mistake as humans that we make is that we care so much about what others think. And a lot of us, we go through things like, you know, myself, I didn't have my dad in my life and that made me feel like I was never good enough. Like I would always try to find that you know, satisfaction in other things around me. So I would be the person in school trying to get the attention from other people because I wanted them to look at me and be like, man, this guy's cool. And I wanted that feeling like, you know, if, if you know where I'm coming from, you know that that feeling that you just want to be accepted, that feeling that you want to, you know, feel loved and feel like someone cares about you. But listen, I, we serve a God who loves you for you. We serve a God that you have value in. And right now I'm speaking to an individual who's like, bro, I'm at this place in life where I just don't know, man. Everybody else is where I wanna be and I wanna be there. Listen, you can't care, shut off the noise. You close that door. It might take you 10 years to get to where you wanna be. It took them one, but who cares about them? Care about you, bro. It's a motivation for you. Get up, do better. Turn off the noise, stop being afraid. Cause it's time to be unafraid and know that we serve a God. 
who has greater plan. We out, man. Until next week.